Hello, my crafty friends. I am back. I have finished <laughs> another cover. But first of all, in my last video, I did um, a uh, Happy Mail from Glitzy Guts at Etsy.com. And I forgot. I'm glad I read your note again, Ellen. I She included these really cute... Um, she covered, completely covered these paper clips. And I just wanted to share them. Aren't those adorable? Just a little dainty work. And then she put a little charm on that. And I got glue all over my hands. So I didn't want to forget them. Good thing I read her note because they were in the envelope and I did not take them out. So, back to another finished memory book set. This is all... Everything is from Crafty Me Shop. There's is the envelope. is an 8x5. It's made out of a class envelope. And it's just all oh, beautiful. Just beautiful trim. Trim and um, chiffon and just laces. That I just draped down. And then in here is a... Um, like a little snippet booklet and just closes with seam binding and it just has some paper and it just has some ephemeral and then I left this I gessoed it so you can write on it you can attach whatever you want on it put some pictures whatever you'd like because I'm using like I said I'm um, getting my mom and my aunts together a little more emotional than I thought so <laughs> keeps going in a pile but we'll get there so that's the envelope and then this is the cover again it's just got all the beautiful trims and I just I love I love having everything hang down that's what I love and this is a nine by six and then in here is I used the um, yesterday's video with Juliana in our little heart shaped box from Esme. She gave me a fat quarter. So I used that in here, just like hints of it. And then the rest of the journal is plain inked up rip paper for nothing but writing. And then in the cover here is in this little bag. Is a little match booklet, a little piece of ephemera, a little guest check, and one of my um, piece of uh, a fan from England, the die cut, and then one of my CD cases, and then an envelope. And you'll probably get some surprise goodies because that's what I like to do. So this I just listed. So that goes in there. And I'll have a piece of seam binding to keep this closed along with this. So what else did I want to show you? Oh, I wanted to show you. I got my, my box with, these are all the um, seed. I only decorated a couple. And then the rest are ready to go. Some I put trim on them. Some I didn't. And then I told my husband that when he comes home tonight, I expect him to bring dinner. So that'll be a pizza. So I put the rest in the box. So when he comes home and we sit in a chair watching Star Trek, the original series, I got my paper in here. I will sit and finish doing that. So that's what I did with that. And I just wanted to do a little craft with how I do. Um, and this is nothing. Just this little um, collage, I guess. Because I love my bags. And I'm going to use tape. So I, I just kind of, I'll get different sizes. And I'll just... You know, if I get this dirty, my daughter will show me. She got me this for <laughs> the good things. And I'll see if we have 
No, we're pretty good. I'm trying to get this straight. It looks straight when I look in the camera, but I'm also stepping on a chair to look in the camera. So we will just usually I fold one. And I, I would use glue, but I have so much of this tape. I, I, I got to start using this stuff. So I'm, I'm not a huge fan of the double-sided tape on certain things because it catches. But something like this, we're good. Come on. My grandson called me because he's still like in quarantine. It's a good thing they have a big house because everybody's in a separate room and dad is cleaning everything. <laughs> Hi, Grandma. What are you doing? Are you working on journals today? He's <laughs> so cute. <laughs> and if you could have seen my granddaughter's face, I'm just going to ink this up. My granddaughter's face when we told Papa that she was on TV. Now, mind you, she's, you know, kind of nonverbal. She'll say a couple things. So she just kept going like this. Me, me. <laughs> and she kept just flipping her hands. Oh, she was so excited. And Papa was watching, and oh, she was just, that thrilled her. That definitely thrilled her. <laughs> and thank you for all the nice comments. And then I'll just kind of take, let's see, the second size. Now, you can make your own bags with paper and so on, but I, again, I just have such a, and then I'll just kind of do them. I'm folding them up because they got to be, can't have more than six because of my. And so the last time I did, I just kind of folded this over <clears throat> because uh, I'm going to do one more. I think I got one more of the fabric lace um, books coming. I got it set up yet. Whether I'll get to it today or not, I don't know. My husband's out plowing, so it'd be a late night until he brings home the pizza, anyway. Right, so we got that. That, gotta make sure I... Because actually, this could take up the whole inside of the book. Oh, here it is right here. Let's use the pretty side, as far as size-wise. They only said we were going to get a couple inches, and I think we're already up to like seven inches. They lied again. Then these, again, if you know your measurements, you can do them ahead of time. Like I said, I know, not always, but 9 by 6 is my favorite size. Sometimes, or, you know, the TNs are, I do them too, but I like the 9 by 6. And then I can just... something to play with if you're you're stuck in a rut or something and you're bored and it's just that we forget how there's so many videos I can't tell you how many times I forget to do something I mean I got a lot of catching up I know G Kerr's going doing a lot of flip books and I'm behind on hers so I have to get going yeah, you're just kind of placing it like that. And then place it loose. If 
like I said, you don't have to go out and buy double tape, sided tape. If you have it, that's fine. If you don't, glue is fine. Or... The only thing I never use and I see people using is a glue gun. And I just have not got my glue gun out. Probably because I burn myself constantly. So, okay. So that's going to fit inside that. So, what we can do is... Oh, we'll just do, I'm going to grab some stuff. I did print out some, you know what, I got another dress, paper doll. So we'll just do, we'll do a little pink to match the pink. And again, this is my quick rip and tear. I got so many, so many projects all over. It's not even funny. But I get, not, I, not that I get bored, but I just, maybe I get stumped on something and I just need to be able to grab something quick. So this is a paper doll dress. Ah, some of the little tabs are so small. Of course, I'm using a Dagunda scissors because I'm too lazy to reach across my desk. The diet thing, <laughs> not going well, ladies, not at all. I think I wiped up, wiped out a whole, whole package of Oreos. I'm hiding them from my husband because he's got more of a sugar problem than I do. So it's like I go in the cupboard. I, I tell my grandson it's grandma's cupboard. It's like grandma's secret cupboard. And I keep all my chocolate in there. Well, it's just about wiped out. I'm not very proud of that, but obviously it don't bother me too much. And... We can just set that in there for now. Because that could be something that you could use. Oh, what else do I have? Let's just do some. I love this yellow. I think this is. Oh, dear. Either Tsunami Rose, maybe? Or Ephemera Pack? I went through all my kits the other day and just kind of printed some stuff off. And I know I got it. I had tons. Tsunami Rose is my first design team. So I have a lot of her stuff. I think Charming Fragments of Tsunami Rose is my first kit. I absolutely love that to this day. It was my starter kit. Before I even knew what digitals were. <laughs> I hope I'm still filming here. What else can we do? I think this needs to be a little more. <clears throat> then I would put, let's see, another tea bag. When you coffee dye these, these, these come out a lot. Either you can tape them back to the bottom, or I just set them aside for something else. Let's see, that can stick out. I can do something with that. What is this? I think that's some kind of a letter. Yeah, as long as you have, like that green is picking up that green, the same writing is picking up that. Just kind of, that's how I, you know, match. Like, all right, what, what match? 
Like if I went to go put this in, oh yeah, that would match. <laughs> um, actually, see. All right, the aqua. I don't have any aqua in there, so like if this was a, if the pink wasn't in there, but see it does match because you have that color in there. All right, that was not a good example. Hmm. Maybe it all matches, and I just need another Oreo. <laughs> oh dear. I think you know what I'm talking about. If not, you can leave me a comment. Inking right on my hand. It's one of those days. Snow is falling off the roof, and that freaks out my dog. I got a big German Shepherd, and he's such a wimp. He is a wimp. And I think I need a flower. Because that's what we do. My deli girl favorite favorite flower just to pull the pink down here and whatever Esme gave me I just love this stuff I wish I knew what it whoops I really don't know what it is but it's pretty awesome and my rose went flying with the glue I haven't forgotten about E and just not 100% comfortable with it yet. <laughs> so I don't want to do a... Alright, to me this looks a little too plain, especially over here. So... Let's see what we got. Ooh. This is perfect. And I am going fast because I don't want to think about it. I just do not want to think because I will change my mind. Just tuck that under there a little. And it looks fine. But we need a little. Oh, let's see. Yep. That'll work. I'm going to tuck this over. I'll let the long one hang down and tuck this over here, this little corner. And that kind of brings everything together in the middle. And there you have it. This I will proudly put. Oh, if this is too big for this. Oh, no, I know I have space. Yep, I would probably put that right there. And then that gives me. What is this? Oh, I did it this way. Oh, well, that goes that way. And I put this there. Possibly. Hmm. Got that there. Ooh, there we go. There's a lot going on there. Okay. That's probably what we'll do. I'll put that there, so that will clip there. I will clip that there, so that's going to stay 
right in place. And you got all the colors and you got more flips and yep. Alrighty, I might be back again because like I'm on a roll. And it's not pizza time yet. So we'll see you soon. Bye.